Let me ask you something. What's the most you ever lost on a coin toss? Look, I need to know what I stand to win. Everything. Just call it friendo. Your character is very ruthless. He, he's a cold-blooded murderer. How do you prepare for a role like that? I have some problems with violence. I still have some problems with portraying violent characters, but I knew that if there was somebody in the world that can pull out uh, a good, I don't know if it's statement is the word, but a good message out of this film and the, this book would be the Coens, so I totally trust. What was it like working with the famous Coen brothers? They're great, they're amazing filmmakers, and the thing is, is they keep mixing it up. They'll go do their comedies, and then they'll do the drama, and then they'll do a mix of. And, but what I always love about even in their heaviest dramas is there's always a bit of absurd humor in there somewhere, and I think you definitely get that in this film. What's in the satchel? It's a bowl of money. And he's just a guy who happened to find that money. I got a bad feeling, Will. They've got this lovely, lovely relationship, and I think the you know, the thing that I really responded to was at the end of the film where you sort of realise that she's got this, you know, core of strength in her as well. She's not just this sort of young, young sweet thing. She, you know, she's, she's strong. She's got this strength. Yeah, I know where you're going. All right. You know she won't be there. It doesn't make any difference where she is. So what are you going up there for? You know how this is going to turn out, don't you? Nope. I think you do. So this is what I'll offer. You bring me the money and I'll let her go. I think he feels like he can protect himself. I think it comes off maybe as a dim uh, decision to make. Mm -hmm. But I think as the movie progresses, I think the guy, you start to realize that the guy can really take care of himself and that he actually might pull it off. Call it.